at a recent rally, Trump did something unprecedented. I don't know if you've heard, but the Georgia State Election Board is in a very positive way. This is a very positive thing, Marjorie. They're on fire. They're doing a great job. Three members. Janice Johnson, Rick Jeffries, and Janelle King. Three people. He singled out three election state officials by their name, calling them fighters for honesty and transparency. But why should this concern us? It is not common for a president to directly name state election officials, especially those involved in certifying election results. Now, these roles are usually seen as neutral, not tied to any political agenda. But by highlighting them, Trump is signaling that a future election outcome could be heavily influenced by their actions and their allegiance. In Georgia, a new rule introduced by the State Election Board gives local officials more leeway to raise concern about the election results. This might sound harmless, but in reality, it could create confusion and delays in certifying the results. Imagine a scenario where the election official starts questioning the outcome, leading to chaos and uncertainty in an already polarized environment. This means in a tight race, which is highly likely, all it takes is one county raising doubts, dragging the certification process beyond November 12th. The deadline for the counties. This could push the certification past December 11th, the critical federal deadline, and into January, right up to the Congress's certification of the Electoral College. Imagine the chaos, the doubts, the media frenzy, the legal battles, and political leverage to question the outcome of an election. With every delay, the political tension escalates, pushing the US dangerously towards civil unrest. What are your thoughts? Can you see how this might spiral out of control? Share your thoughts and hit follow to stay in the loop.